adult learning theories, whenever I see this, the adult qualifier to me, I was always like, yeah, I'm not sure how to interpret that because I didn't come at this from a teaching background and I didn't have to fight that stigma that, oh, you were a teacher, so you can only teach kids, which is a real stigma. I know teachers deal with that in this field, talking about the times where maybe you've done some coaching or professional development for adults and just emphasizing here is how it's different. And I have experience doing that. I would put these in the need to know because in my experience coming from teaching, teachers get asked, well, you've always worked with children. How do you know how to teach adults? What we call andragogy, which is different from pedagogy. The main thing here is pulling them away from age. Because I was always asked this in interviews, I wanted to make sure I knew about adult learning theory. How can we possibly know all of these? <laughs> I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. You won't. We don't, yeah. To be quite honest, a lot of these, are just labeling things we already do. 